Cliff, and I'm here with Jeffrey Rudensky. You pitched an amazing two inning save. What's that make you feel? You guys beat Pequa. You guys are two two rounds in, moving on to the finals. You're either playing Plainview or Farmingdale. What should we expect in the upcoming series? We should expect a great series. You know, we have a great chance to win it. You know, we have great team, great offense, great defense, great pitching. I think we'll do good in the championship. What was going through your head? You had that final out. You did walk two batters. What was going through your head? That pitch left your hand, and you saw him swing. You know, stay calm. Work. Just make sure I get the pitch where I need it to be, and work that well. All right, we'll see you at Farmingdale State College at 10 a.m. on Saturday. 3-2 pitch. Take it for a call. Strike three. He got him looking. Two. The wind up. The 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a miss. Strike three. He got him on a curveball down low. Wilbur's gonna set up outside. It's Kurt Hall. Did he go? Yes, he did. Cold swing and a miss. As Delonzo strikes out for the second time this game. The one two from Treneman to Sultana. Cold strike three on the outside corner. He got him. Two down in the two two. Runner goes, hits on the ground. Base hit. Mysella will hold at second. And Spurita bites the hold. He does. The 3 2. Swinging a high fly ball. Deep left field. Looking back is the left fielder. And he can't make the catch. It's down. Corber coming in to score. And Squish scores. It's 4 1 Vikings here in the bottom of the sixth. DL1. Hit in the air to left center field. Iorio's back. He makes the catch. We're headed to a game three in Massapequa on Wednesday night. I'm here with starting pitcher Hunter Treneman. Hunter, complete game. What's going through your head right now sealing this win? Um, I'm just happy that our season's still alive and that we got the job done. Uh, I had a plan coming into today and uh, felt like I executed pretty well, except for the one run in the second. But uh, great game. We got the win and on to game three. You helped seal the series against Iosset. Now you're helping this team live another day. How do you keep doing this? What's your motivation to keep going? My motivation to keep going is I love baseball and I love Fort Baseball. I love this team. I love these guys. We play for everyone and uh, so many people stepped up today and that's that's really been the MO of this team. The crucial game three comes on Wednesday. How are you guys going to move forward and hopefully seal the series? We're winning game three. That's all I can tell you. Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> I'm Ryan Baxter alongside Jake Charlotte, the man who hit the go-ahead run. Jake, it was a 3-2 count when that ball hit the barrel. What's going through your head? Um, just knowing that I got a few runs for my team, you know, 2-1 going to last inning, you know, against a team like that, it's not going to cut it. So knowing that I helped out my team, made it easier for Hunter and got the job done. You are coming off just a day prior, letting up the walk-off run, losing one nothing against Massapequa. How did you come back in this game mentally to make sure you're going to do the right thing? You know, it's tough because same thing happened to me uh, earlier in the season. You know, they walked me off earlier in the season. Knew I had to come back and do something, and I just believed in myself, believed in my guys, and got it done. You guys have game three of this series on Wednesday. How do you plan to move forward and hopefully capture the series? Do what we do. You know, we fight. No one else believes in us, but we believe in ourselves, and I love my guys. I do everything for them, and it's what we do. All right, thank you very much. Congratulations. Thank you. All right, we're here with the two steeple champs, um, Eve and Lucas. Eve, how do you feel about your race? I feel great. It was um, a back and forth with me and, and my other competitor, and um, and I was, I was able to win, and it was, it was a kick to the end, and I was really happy and excited. Lucas, how do you feel? I feel pretty good. Um, got out pretty hard and just kind of settled into a good pace and managed to finish strong. Yeah. So I'm really happy about it. Yeah.